set up dinner. Shame, but I'm gonna set up dinner back home. The Super 8 camera. When I was a kid, it's always my, been my dream camera. I love you. I love you forever and ever, babe. I knew I wanted to spend the rest of my life with you. You're my Hi guys. The film opens by showing two brides and grooms happily getting married. But it turns out it was just a video recording made by the actor in this film. His name is David. It is known that David is a photographer, where he is showing his video results to prospective clients. And after chatting, the client finally agreed to use David's services for his upcoming wedding. When night fell, David was given a surprise by his friends, who found out that today was his birthday. His friends gave him a surprise, and it turned out that his wife was the surprise. David's wife's name is Nike. Nike is a flight attendant. Of course you also know that flight attendants rarely come home. Of course David didn't think that his wife would be able to come home on her birthday. Therefore, after the party, while his wife was here, David immediately took his wife to the back and carried out the activities that all the spectators wanted. Long story short, David and his assistant started working to photograph his client at the wedding. Until when they will take photos in the outside area. His assistant David was careless, keeping a bag containing his work folders by the pool. Until a few moments later. There was a naughty boy who deliberately kicked the bag until it sank. Of course the results of their work will be in vain. The results of their work were lost just because of the carelessness of his assistant David. Due to his assistant's mistake, David himself and David's village photography company were also required to pay huge compensation, around one million dollars. Because there was no way to find that amount of money, they were forced to sell all their work assets to pay off the compensation. Long story short, two years passed. David, who no longer has any assets, is now bankrupt and forced to be unemployed. David spends his days just doing housework such as mopping, sweeping, washing dishes and other housework. Nike as a wife tries to help her husband return to work again. However, because he was still deeply traumatized by the failure in his business, David couldn't forget and refused to do business again. A short time at night, when Nike was sleeping, she suddenly dreamed of sleeping with her pilot. Then the next day Nike told his friend. There they even thought that Nike herself must have had an illicit relationship with the pilot. And sure enough, how could Nike not? I can imagine, if at the airport the pilot always helped Nike with. Brought Nike his luggage. The pilot was even willing to take Nike home. Even though he himself knew that Nike actually already had a husband. How could that happen, like him, if Nike was noticed by the pilot who was definitely rich, and his salary was very big? When David was at home, as a husband, he wanted heating, but instead of serving his husband, Nike refused. David suddenly became suspicious and felt that something was wrong with his wife. Finally, David's suspicions were clarified, with evidence of Nike's chat with the pilot, which he saw himself on his wife's cell phone. One evening Nike was invited to dinner by the pilot and other flight staff. Finally, David decided to join him for dinner with his wife there. David's suspicions became clearer, because Nike's gaze and smile were always focused on the pilot. This made David, as a husband, very jealous and angry with Nike. He even accused his wife of having slept with the pilot. Oh. Parang ako pa hindi hihiya sa inyong dalawa? Ano ka nagtatalaga? 
klaseng pagmamaneho yun. Ano sagot? Long story short, as David's former assistant and friend, his former assistant also tried to cheer up David by giving him tickets for a holiday to an island. Because he was stressed by life at home, David finally received the holiday ticket. And now David's holiday trip has begun. And on the first day, David woke up from his stupor because he had eaten poisonous leaves. However, when David woke up, he immediately looked for his wedding ring, which he had dropped because it was missing from his finger. But there was a beautiful woman who was doing yoga, her name was Tasya. David immediately continued to pay attention to the woman. Because he saw that woman whose body looked like a guitar. However, the woman immediately became angry with David. Because of its existence interfere with his yoga activities. Even though it was Tasya herself who disturbed David's loyalty because she wore sexy clothes. When night fell, David met Tasya again. This time David tried to get him to talk. And as an apology David treated Tasya to dinner. Here Tasya tells us that she is a designer who is on holiday on the island. Because Tasya's character is not boring and is very fun to talk to. For some reason, Tasya suddenly danced alone in front of David when she heard music. Jazz. Of course, this made David interested and counted out his eyes. On the other hand, Nike, who was alone at home, was again invited to dinner by the pilot. The pilot really tried to win Nike's heart with his kindness. Even the pilot started to dare to touch his Nike. Here Nike suddenly realized, and remembered her husband, she finally rejected the pilot's advances, and left the pilot the the next morning David and Tasia's close relationship really became more passionate. Last night they slept together, and were like lovers. Meanwhile, Nike, who missed her husband, finally followed him to David's vacation spot. After arriving at the villa, Nike and David were reunited, but suddenly Tasia suddenly arrived and took her panties, which were left behind. Of course Nike as a wife. Suspicious, and finally very angry with David. Even Tasia. Even himself, he became angry and unclear, because of the presence of David's wife's Nikes. Later that day, Tasia looked for information about David's wife's Nikes. He deliberately joined the yoga group that Nike was joining at that time. Nike was disturbed by Tasia's arrival. He told Tasia not to interfere in his household affairs. But again, Tasia boldly said that she felt challenged to continue approaching David. The next day David received a package. The package contained a camera. At first David thought the package was a surprise from his wife, but apparently the package was from Tasia. So David finally went to Tasia's house, intending to return the item, and wanting to settle all his matters with Tasia, so that his household would be with Nike. Return to normal. But when he met Tasia, Tasia actually poured out her heart to him David, if she had been injured by her husband. Meanwhile Nike itself meet her husband. Tasia, who was at work, finally told her that Tasia had a mental disorder, and now he was acting out, pretending that he had been hurt by him. And according to her husband, Tasia's next target was a man named David. Returning to David and Tasia, their Tasia suddenly forced David to take off all his clothes, but David, who intended to solve the problem, did not comply with Tasia's wishes at all and immediately left her. A short time when Tasia's husband came home from work, Tasia suddenly seduced her husband, but instead making out, Tasia suddenly strangled her husband until he died instantly.
Meanwhile, now. It was David's turn to find out information about Tasia. And this is where he finally finds out that Tasia is not a normal person. The next night when Nike was outside, she was suddenly hit by Tasia. Because she was so annoyed with her, Nike responded to Tasia by grabbing her hair, which was still there. In his car, it didn't end here. Tasia responded to Nike's treatment by coming to Nike's house, there she beat Nike. Even holding him captive, David, who had just come in from outside. And instead he was shot in the shoulder and pain. In the end Nike managed to untie the knot, and began to fight against C. Tasia's actions. Nike received a cut on her cheek, while David, seeing his wife cornered in pain, pushed her bag from the balcony until it fell. But strangely, whatever knowledge Tasia used, she was able to get up again, even though she had fallen from the top floor. Here Nike also took Tasia's gun, then fired the bullets until it made. Tasia died right then and there. Long story short some time passed, now David is said to have returned to work opening a photography service again. Because David's talent is photography, which of course is all supported by his wife. Now David and Nike have forgiven each other for their mistakes, and returned to a good household. Although now Nike has the wound on his cheek, then the film ends. Thank you for watching, don't forget to click like and subscribe.